Hello students, welcome to lecture number 17. Title for today's session is Batch Production. I Dr. Om Prabhakar Devale welcome you all. This is online lecture series for the subject Operations and Supply Chain Management. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Learning objectives for today's session. To know the basic concepts of batch production. To understand the merits and demerits of batch production along with few examples. Batch production. We will start with the concept. Batch production is a technique used in manufacturing in which the object in question is created stage by stage. Over a series of workstation and different batches of products are made. Together with job production and mass production, it is one of the three main production methods. Batch production is a method used to produce similar item in group stage by stage. In batch production, the product goes through each stage of the process together before moving on to the next stage. The degree to which workers are involved in this type of production depends on the type of product. It is common for machineries to be used in for the actual production and worker participants only at the beginning and end of the process. Batch production is used for many type of manufacturing that may need smaller amount of production at a time to ensure specific quality standards or changes in the process. This is opposed to large mass production for continuous production methods where the product or process does not need to be checked or changed as frequently or periodically. Batch production is a method of manufacturing where the products are made as specific group of amount within a time frame. A batch can go through a series of steps in a large manufacturing process to make the final desired product. Batch production is most common in bakeries and in the manufacturing of various items like sports shoes, pharmaceutical ingredients, purifying water, inks, paints and adhesives. In the manufacturing of ink and paints, a technique called color run is used. A color run is where the manufacturer starts with the lightest color first, such as light yellow, followed by the next increasing darker color, such as orange. Then manufacturer chooses red and so on until reaching to black and then starts over and again. This is the example of batch production where raw materials are there then these raw materials are under process in work in process inventory then finally in the batch finished goods are manufactured now we will see few examples of batch production electric goods are the example of batch production similarly baked goods books and newspaper pharmaceutical products fast food products and textile industries. These are example of batch production. Now we will try to get the answer for this question. Why do manufacturers use batch production? Why batch production? It's recommended to use this form of manufacturing when producing in smaller quantities because this can reduce waste and decrease lead times in production. As these products are not continuously made Manufacturers can charge a premium price for their product but still make them in some cases as relatively cheap prices thanks to mass production of that batch. The ability of these mass production oriented machinery systems include assembling product components involving control and testing capabilities and building in a no fault forward mechanism. This ensures the level of incorrect batches that might be pulled through to the next process are kept to a minimum. Now we will see key benefits of batch production. Key benefits of batch production. It can reduce initial capital outlay. That is the cost of setting up the machineries because a single production line can be used to produce several products at a time or in batches. Batch production can be useful for small businesses that cannot afford to run continuous production lines. 
if a retailer buys a batch of product that does not sell then the producer can cease production without having to sustain huge losses batch production is useful for a factory that makes seasonal products or seasonal items for which it is difficult to forecast demand a trial run of production or products that can have high profit margins can be produced through batch production you will continue with the key benefits the key benefit is cheaper to produce a whole batch of a product than a single item at a time machineries can be utilized more efficiently therefore saving money for the business then it reduces the risk of concentrating on one product that allows for flexibility one of the key benefit is the overall wastage is reduced by creating the correct number of products required it helps to contingency planning that is if one batch has been spoiled the cost is lower to discard the batch as opposed to thousands of products on a continuous cycle it is useful for seasonal items due to the ability to order more or less of a particular item and the last benefit is the machinery isn't continually acting allow running costs to be reduced these were some key benefits now we will understand key disadvantage that is the merits of batch production each batch can be subject to meticulously quality control and assurances potentially causing increased employee downtime increased storage cost for large quantities of produce products errors with the batch produce will incur wasted time and cost periods of downtime where the specialist machineries must be altered that is workers sitting idle and can be considered inefficient if you are solely relying on the machines for this process one of the disadvantage is the product cannot be personalized or unique to be individual customer due to being a batch production process so these are key disadvantages of batch production this is the book of simba publication in my next video we will learn assembly line production learning outcomes from today's session we have understood the basic concepts of batch production we have seen merits and demerits of batch production along with various examples of batch production don't forget to like share comment subscribe and turn on the bell icon for further notifications thanks for watching this video keep thinking keep learning these are some references i have used to prepare this video